And so today we're going to do a lab called freezing point depression. We're going to use the effect, the colligative property, the effect of freezing point depression to determine the molar mass, the empirical formula, and molecular formula, formula of an unknown compound. So as, for, as you can see here, I had to set up the uh, logger probe to measure the uh, temperature. And this is our temperature probe. And the first step in this, uh, in this lab is to measure five grams, approximately, of lauric acid, which is going to be our solvent. Now, uh, we're going to add the chloric acid to the test tube. OK, so now we have added the uh, lauric acid to the test tube. Uh, but before I proceed, because some of the lauric acid was left in our way boat, this is the mass of the, the amount of lauric acid that did not get into the test tube. OK, so now we're going to place the lauric acid in the water bath, which is at 61 degrees. And we're going to melt the lauric acid. And we're going to add the temperature probe, we can, which we can use as a stirrer, but being careful, however, that the core does not touch the hot plate. Now the lauric acid is fully melted. We're going to place it back onto the stand and we're going to begin collecting data with Logger Pro. And now we have come to the end of our run. We have collected the all the data possible. I will save this uh, logger profile and make the data available to you so that you can um, derive the freezing point of, uh, of lauric acid from it. OK, so now we're going to add 0.75 grams of the unknown solute. And that's pretty close to 0.75. OK, so now we're going to carefully remove the probe, temperature probe, and we'll set it up to where we don't lose any of the lauric acid very gently. And we will take this test tube and add the unknown solute to it. OK, we have added the unknown. I will put this here, back here. And next, I'm going to weigh the small weigh boat again so that I can find out how much unknown I actually have added to the test tube. OK, so now I'm going to put the probe back in the test tube. And I'm going to put the test tube in the hot water. And the temperature of this water bath is uh, 51 degrees Celsius. And I'm going to proceed to melt the, the mixture. And now it's fully melted. And we're taking it out of the bath. And uh, we're going to place it onto the stand. And we're going to start recording. And so we have collected all the data that we need to collect. Uh, I will provide this uh, graph to you. And uh, your job now is to turn in a lab report using the lab template, lab report template that is being provided to you.